everybody. We just completed the uh, the Spartanburg. Uh, Spartanburg. Spartan Beast. That uh, was a good yeah. time. There's a little bling, a little metal for you. Yeah, that was our first time kind of out of the New England area, so that was a good time. That was a fun travel. Or, uh, Interesting travel. You can see it's part of our hotel our classy, behind us. Our classy hotel. It's super classy. We're and, posting uh, some pictures of this place <laughs> and some reviews. <laughs> get so many yeah. stars it's going to get. I think it was like yeah. three stars or something. Yeah. So I don't There's agree with that. Some differences in the stars between Obvious, where we're from. Obviously, you can hear we're very close to the highway. Right. And uh, you could hear the highway and feel the wind <laughs> blowing in because the door is not like all the way closed and the shower's kind of falling apart. Yeah, good time. Yeah. You know what? It was a very cool race. It yes. was like the they've got an absolute ton of rain this week. So the course was just absolutely muddy, and they they said they had to modify it a little bit. And we were in the water a lot, right? But there was mud just constantly. They they had to modify it too, and I'm sure a lot of people were pissed. I was pissed originally when I was looking at the map on the plane. It was like all of the signature big time obstacles, all of the arm burning things, were stacked up like right on top of each other. They it was were, like rope I mean, climb, Olympus, yep. Twister. They were like all right there. I mean, they put them since it was like the sprint and the beast together. So it's kind of made sure it was in the sprint version, but they also stacked them up so that everyone in the festival area could witness and hang out and watch them. I have to say but, though, after doing it, I'm glad they did. Yeah. It was like right yep. in the beginning and uh, we were fresh and we attacked those and had a good go of it. So. Yeah. Sir Garfield, well done. Cheers. Yep. It was, it was, that was good. Great course layout, yep. um, especially with the terrible, terrible weather that the place had. There was a couple of spots where it was just like run, 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 run. It was like a mile, and then there was an obstacle that was like, eh, okay. But I, I thought they did good. I thought the ending was awesome. The, the ending was a surprise because it was yeah. like, oh, duck wall, slip wall. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. It was a fire jump photo. Right. Wow. They had these pits. That you had to go in with this. Yeah. You can see they some had at, of it. They had them at West Point too, but West Point ones were just like flat. This, like this one, they just piled it up, so you had to try to climb up. This thick orange. Yeah, that clay South mud, Carolina it is. clay. It's very gloppy and very slippery, and it's also adhesive. It, it, it sticks, yeah. right? So you go in these pits, and it was hard to get the fuck out of there. It was like <laughs> that's, that's people right. scrambling and yep. shit. I was like, okay, all right, that was a nice twist. They yeah. really made you work for it at the end. Yeah. And speaking of the gloppy, um, sticky clay, you know, that's the reason why I have the hood on. <laughs> it's in there. And it's got some really great hold. It's in, it's in the hair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well so. done. Well done. <laughs> well done, Kramer. <laughs> right. We just go put that back on. <laughs> so, uh, it was, you know, they said on the map, actually, Garfield, the course designer, said it was around 14. It, it wasn't. It was less. Yeah. And, and they had signs for 13. It wasn't. It was less. It was like you know what? It 12 was like and three quarters. The mile markers matched up for like the for the sprint length. Yes. Like exactly when our watches were beeping for a mile. And then the they, mile sign was right there. They must have been like, yo, fuck it. Just put the signs in. <laughs> then all of a sudden they on. were Let's like. Get out of here. Yeah, they were like a tenth off. And they, I mean, it got back almost like a half a mile towards the end. Yes. Yep. And they did say they had to shorten the course. So, like, that's cool. It was but like, it was, all the yeah. signature ones were there. There was another short twister. It was only two rungs rather than three. Yeah. I was happy yep. to see that. Yep. First time in a long time the spear that I picked up was perfectly straight. So, I was like, all right. The shaft was straight. The point was straight. I was like, okay, cool. Yeah, the one guy to my left was about to throw it. And I looked at it. And it looked like a banana. And he threw it and he missed. I was like, nope. No way. We'll take no, the next one. No way. Yeah. So I'll wait. After the signature obstacles, it was like this is just fun. It's like all right, let's, let's yeah. have a nice little Saturday. <laughs> Eight foot wall, okay. Monkey bars, no problems. Like, I love the monkey like, bars. Like multi rig is still great, but it was like it's not hard. I hadn't done a rope traverse this whole year. Yeah. Just happy with that. Yeah. That was shorter too. And West Point, the spear throw was closer. Here it was more realistic. 
was like yeah. more it 25 was, foot. And it was, but it was slightly like downhill as well. Which, yeah, was, which like, was also nice. Was like, so it was, yeah. We lucked out. You know, they got fucking hammered with rain and cold it's ass temperatures. Like perfect day. It was like a little chilly. I was chilly. obsessing over the weather. I was watching the weather. What should I pack? What, how's it going to be? You know that? We lucked out. It was about 34, 35 degrees in the morning. Yeah. We were cold for like two seconds. Yeah. Even before we got going, gloves, hat, all that shit came off. And we were perfectly, perfectly comfortable, I think, I felt the great. rest of the day. Yep. So it was pretty cool. The only difference down here with this one, um, the type of mud, that red Yeah, that was really slippery. Clay. And you could see, like, you knew when to slow down because you could just see where people were just sliding and you could see their shoes. Like, no shoes were grabbing into it. They had a couple of river crossings. Yep. You walked in or walked across. Yeah. One of them was some rushing. Was, it yeah, actually one of them pushed was like, me a They had bit. the ropes. That was cool. They had the ropes in there. It was like, that's where I'm like, they probably should have a lifeguard or yeah, something no just in case someone kind of fell or can't swim. If you uh, are used to running in the Northeast, you're used to doing like Tuxedo or Killington. Yeah. This place is flat. It's really. You know, that's it's, not a knock. I'm not yeah. trying to be a dick, but it's fucking flat. It's flat. It's really nice. It really, like, really nice. Yeah. And our last Ultra wasn't actually an Ultra. It was the Ultra Beast before right. they switched to two two laps uh, of a beast. Yeah, so Jersey. So, so it was way uh, way more elevation. So we're gonna know. we're gonna jump back into that game and do another one. Mm -hmm. But if I had to pick, I would love to do it here. Definitely, it's like so much better than like Definitely. in New Jersey. There's no mountains. There's there's no, no nothing. I was like, unless they somehow do one in English Town, New Jersey, at the raceway where it's just even flatter. The only thing you got to watch out for the hunting stands. Yeah. Fucking hunting all over the place. It was On a like, college campus. Well, yeah. you know, depends. Maybe yep. that's a subject yep. or something. I don't. Know. Cool, cool venue. It was mm -hmm. like I think if there was no rain, like this place could be like really, really dry. Yeah, but, but I don't know. I, I thought the course was cool. A bunch of pre-cut trails you could tell. Right. And then they just bushwhacked a bunch of stuff. And the bushwhack like, ones weren't bad though, yeah, and there was not were. a lot of traffic. Like you would sometimes like stack up. And, yeah. No complaints. Good time, and we really lucked out with the weather. It's got to be at least 60 degrees right now. It's perfect. It's yeah. middle of November, so no complaints there. And uh, the other thing is Walmarts down here have <laughs> beer. All right? <laughs> Cut frame, flash frame to that footage. All right, so here we are in Walmart. We have uh, opted to find one so that we could buy some things that we didn't want to pack, namely like chem lights. We didn't know if we were going to get pinched or whatever. And we have a nice rental car that we didn't take any insurance on, so we got some towels so we wouldn't mud up the place. But the best thing of all, and you might laugh if uh, you don't have a situation like ours, here in Walmart, not only could you get a cooler and towels and chem lights, but they also sell beer. So I was like, Damer, we, we live in the wrong place. <laughs> and are you kidding? Not only do they have beer, but they have Guinness. Is it, I'm like giddy. <laughs> this place rules. All right. Thank you. <laughs> That's right. So th this we, place is all right, man. We got our cooler, our beer, spare towels. Yeah. <laughs> it was like all yeah. for like eight bucks. Absolutely. <laughs> awesome. So uh, highly recommended. Great time. Great race. And uh, this concludes our 2018 Race yeah, season. We're done. So. But there were a few obstacles here that I think we're gonna try to build, so maybe some build right. obstacles right. coming. And and we also yeah. liked the variation on the stairway to Spata. Yeah, right? that was really nice. It wasn't stuff. just the you know the eight foot wood that you have to get over to get to the you know like the two by fours or whatever it is, the yeah. slats. Yep, they moved that all up higher. Right, they had another four foot section or so, or yeah. maybe more with um, handholds on it. You'll see the footage. Climbing or uh, kids, yeah. <laughs> kids the, the Walmart climbing. brand. Yeah, <laughs> we saw them at the Walmart. We should have gotten some. They, they, yeah, they're definitely slippery and not that good, and definitely made you have to work to get yourself right set. So yeah, that was a, that was that a was nice cool. take. So, so doing I've been building something like that, doing a smaller version uh -huh. of that, that would that's a definite. I would I would like to see that. And Olympus is an awesome obstacle. So we I think we need to build. We that need one. to build something like that. We do Olympus on one side, and we'll yeah. build something else on that's the great other. Great idea, multi-purpose inverted wall or it's something. So that's so. it, everybody. Thanks for watching. Yep. So. And uh, we're gonna enjoy some Guinnesses and then go out and have some. I don't know. 
barbecue or something. That's right. Down here. We're here. So, Damer and Mac signing off. Catch you next time. Cheers. two little ones that I already put in there and then whatever they provide which I don't know what that is <laughs> you can use some of mine <laughs> save me a little <laughs> a tiny bit please